Hi, my name is Anthony. I'm a volunteer here at the Military Museum of New Jersey. This is a 1942 Ford GPW. It was delivered to the U.S. Army back in October of 1942 from the Richmond, California plant. Uh, I privately own this. I've owned it for about three years now. Uh, as far as we know, it came from uh, California. It was owned by a Navy World War II veteran in California before I uh, purchased it from him. Uh, it might have went over to the Pacific, but we're not sure with the records, but there are serial numbers that came back from the Pacific and sold mm -hmm. at a uh, dealership back then in 1946. And out of the, the serial numbers, mine is, is missing out of 20. So mine is 7711, there was one sold 7721, uh, 29 or, mm -hmm. you know, so we're not 100% sure. So this was overseas and it was probably restored? Uh, we're not 100% it was overseas, usually in 1942s, Ford, uh, G, uh, GPWs, they usually kept them in the States, mm -hmm. in 43, uh, they mostly sent them overseas. But there's a chance this could have went over to the Pacific or Europe. Uh, I noticed when you were driving over here, it didn't have power steering, did it? No, it's a four-cylinder L134 engine. Okay. It's very simple. It's a three-speed, no, no I, air conditioning, no. I couldn't help to, to notice that you were really turning that wheel, you know? Yeah. So they get a good view of that engine there. And you, you also sit on a gas tank here. Oh, get the gas tank there. That's where you'll put the gas in. Oh, okay. This also, it came with a mount. I usually have a replica 50 caliber or a 30 caliber machine gun on it. There's a replica M1 oh, brand. So is that, is, is that, does that actually fire that replica? No, no. Oh, okay. Unfortunately, we're in Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> you want to fire it up? Yeah. She runs good for an over 80 year old Jeep. Yeah, absolutely. It looks great, man. I guess it wasn't designed for comfort. No, not at all. And the top speed is like 45. I had it up to 50 and it was pretty interesting. All right. I'm assuming that canopy comes down too? Yes. Your air conditioning with the canopy mm -hmm. was the windshield would slide open. If you kept the canopy on. That will be your air conditioning. It goes up a lot more, and then sometimes the GIs will fold this up so the wind will blow right through it. Okay. I like that. That's cool. Thank you. You're welcome. Hi. Thanks for watching. If you like what you see, hit that like button and also subscribe to this channel. For more exclusive content about this museum, check in the description below where you will find the YouTube channel of the museum. Better yet, if you're in the area, Go check out the museum. It's one thing to see it on YouTube. It's another thing to see in person. Thanks for watching.